Alright guys, uh, <clears throat> this is Lazy for Nothing and today I'll be reviewing uh, Tractor Scratch Pro. Okay, so this is for all you DJs who uh, are looking for good software, uh, I'll tell you my per good personal opinion. Okay, so I already opened mine and mine is already set up all over there. As you can see, because this is stupid slow. Zoom. Okay, so I already opened mine. Uh, so when you buy it, it's a pretty big box. It's pretty hefty. So look in the back. Um, shows you the audio aid, everything, the software, how to set it up, cables, and then the audio aid again. And then it shows for the awards, whatever. Then all the specs and description and everything that you want. Okay, so you open it. Oh, what's this? Well, these are vinyls. Uh, it's not just any vinyls, they're control vinyls. In other words, time codes. Which I hope you guys know what that means because, yeah. Okay. Uh, also, I'm going to get the software, which I already installed, then the control discs. So that's the vinyl, and this is the disc. So both of them are the same thing. Just one's for turntablists and one's for. Uh, CD decks, CD DJs. Uh, you get a $10 Beatport gift card. Your Quick Start guide. I have my. Um, you also get your uh, Getting Started one. Um, and yeah, this is the activation code. I'm blocking the code so you cannot see it. Sorry, guys. I'm gonna have to get a crack from someone else. Well, the code, sorry. Stickers. Yes, they are missing because I used some of them. Also, uh, I, I wasn't. I, mean, I don't remember if this was on top. This just to uh, show you how to set up tractor. So you might be a farmer and you might need help. So just no, I'm just kidding. That's that's Alaskan's joke. Uh, yeah. So this is for CDs and this is for vinyls. So it shows for both. Oh, it, it's it's everything's missing. Well, would you look at that? All my wires are set up. Yeah. No. Okay. These wires are. Uh, you have an in. And you have two outs. One uh, says mixer phono CD line, which means that is what is directly from the turntable. Whereas mixer line, that is what comes from the software. So both of them, and then just plug them in like this. So the red and black is the in, and the Yellow and white is the out. And then you have your USB. Also, as you can see, it's uh, everything is lit. Okay, so <clears throat> one of the first things I want you to guys to notice is the red light right here lit up. Uh, it's not very clear, but what it says is software lock. What that means is that now. I cannot change the input mode channel A B. So usually you would have control vinyl, control C D line, and phono. And the button right here would change these. But since uh mine is already synced and I already installed everything, now it recognizes that it's C D I can always use control C D line that I never change it. So now it's on software lock, meaning that the software programmed it. Actually, no, when, it's when you install it. You have to change it. And once it's installed, you cannot change it unless you use it on another computer. So that's one of the features that comes. So it's on software lock, so you can no longer change it. So what you have to do is go on the software and figure it out. Anyways, okay. So the channel in, the channel out, the channel uh, channel A in, channel B out, 
uh, channel A out, channel B in, uh, channel C out, and channel D out, and then channel C in, and channel C mic, then uh, the channel D in, and then the MIDI in out. Um, uh, what, I want, what I want to talk about a little is uh, channel C is the channel that pretty much has everything. What I mean by that is that there's the mic in, and there's the in for the third turntable, and also you could change it from mic to line. And then you have your mic volume. Okay. So that was a quick review on uh, Tractor Scratch Pro, what comes with it. Um, so uh, I'll make another video soon uh, showing you guys the actual software. So uh, have a good time DJing.